All right, guys, there's a lot of videos out there about how to install Kodi or how to do your add-ons or this, that, and the other thing. There isn't a lot out there for people who just want to understand how to use it. So I've got an Amazon Fire Stick here. It is preloaded with Kodi. That part's all done. When you start up the Fire Stick, this is the first thing you're going to see. Um, you'll notice in your recent, if it's been set up, usually Kodi will be right there. If Kodi isn't there, that big K app, then you can go down, scroll down to apps, and your app library it should be in this list as well. Then you just select on the Kodi app, and this is what's going to come up for you. Um, there's system, programs, music, videos, and pictures. Because this is also meant, well, was mainly originally meant for being just a regular media player, but now all your add ons is what makes it so much more useful these days. Um, not going to go into all the add ons. Whatever you've got installed already is going to be under add ons right there. If you select that, it'll show you all the add ons that you've got installed. And obviously, you can get other add ons. This isn't everything that's available, but this is a good amount of the the good stuff, let's say. Um, and if you want to watch TVs and movies, um, the best app that I find is Exodus. Just select that, and you can select movies, TV, you can favorite things, you can check out the new episodes, new movies. Uh, I usually select movies. My favorite category to scroll down to is in theaters here. And that'll show you whatever the newest stuff that's available is. Sometimes they're up there without any streams yet. Like, for example, I'm pretty sure Nerve doesn't have any streams yet. Um, we'll see in a second. Yeah, see it says no streams available in the bottom corner there. That just means that it's not available. There isn't a copy of it anywhere yet. But eventually there will be. Um, there's a lot of good new stuff up here already. Um, if you go back, using the back button on your remote, you can always exit out of anything by hitting the home button or the back button. Um, you can search by genre, year, people, um, most popular, the ones that are people watching, biggest box office hits. That's a great category because you got a lot of... Uh, all-time great movies in there um, and then like I said you can check out the other add-ons but this one's the one that I use mostly because it's got just about everything you could ever want um, also if you want to install more add-ons uh, installed with one of my sticks I don't know about anybody else's in programs but if you go to programs here go to program add-ons an add-on installer you get you can search you can get the featured add-ons see the video add-ons the audio add-ons um, adult even you can uh, do um, installer settings you know but whatever uh, whatever floats your boat but say for instance we wanted to check out more video add-ons you can select video add-ons, you can scroll through, see anything that catches your eye that you really wanted to uh, set up. And simple as just clicking on it. And you just install it, click right there, Croatia On Demand, there we go. Now that's installed on your system, and then once you install it from there, you can go back, once again using the back button, and that will show up in your video add-ons over here. It'll be under same name, Croatia, whatever. Um, and then that way you can expand the content that you've already got, and if you have any issues with any of the add-ons that are loaded, if you just select the add-on, and hold the button down it'll come up with that screen on the left there it says add on information add to favorites add on settings I'm going to select add on information and you can try to update it or you can also uh, go to uninstall 
And let's uninstall Hulu Box real quick. All right, so now that's uninstalled, we go back over to Programs, go to Add-on Installer, and Video Add-ons. And let's find Hulu Box real quick. There we go, Hulu Box. Select it, install it. Now it's been installed. You'll be able to go back once again to your videos, add ons, and there's Hulu Box again. All right. Any questions, feel free to reach out, but that's a basic breakdown of how to use the Kodi system and how to just find the things you want to watch. Take care, everybody.